Yeah. Okay. So from the top of the backswing, if you go up to the top, that's it. If you swing back, great. So what we're trying to feel here is that instead of that right shoulder tucking back and going at it that way, which is that left hip going forward, I want you to feel that everything spins out over here. So I want you to try and throw the club and the hands out in front of you and then feel like you're then pulling across. So what we want to see on the Trackman screen here is we want to see this, see how severely in to out we've got at the moment. So this, this is very much that way. So what we're going to try and do is get that nice and straight. Okay. Okay. So, let's see what that path looks like. Okay, so you've moved it in quite a bit there. Uh, your clubhead speed went up a bit. Your attack angle though is nearly three degrees on the up. Club face is square, so you're getting the face square, but the strike is, is down. Okay, well that does look a little bit better. Club doesn't look as far behind you here. Yeah. So, if I can show you. So, if we can get it so that from the top of the backswing, instead of going that way into it, we can go a little bit more out. So, leave your hands up there for longer. So, I want you to feel like you go up, out, and left. So, if I exaggerate that, we should get on track, man. That's slightly different position. So, I'll just do one. So, up, out, and across. So, we should get this going more diagonally this time. There you go. So that's an exaggeration of what we're heading towards. If we could try and get that a little bit more, then we're on the right track then. We'll get it. So we need to go up. Leave your hands up there. Up, out. That's it. And then across. As if you're playing a little fade. Okay, standard. Quite a nice contact there. Let's have a look at our track man result. Okay, it's getting better. We're heading in the right direction. We've still got an in-to-out path, but the attack angle's dropped down a bit more. So that's better. So that's only one degree on the up. The club face, though, you have, you, that's really improving. If we look at the uh, picture of that. So we're just trying to see the hands and the club just yeah, a little bit too far behind you there. And that right shoulder is sort of tucking back. Yeah. want the right shoulder to come out more. So if you practice that drill going up, out and across, see if we can try and get that feeling of going up, leaving the hand, that's it, and then swinging left. That's it. If we could just neutralize that path, that would be better. That's not too bad for the driver. If you, if you have the driver on this path, this into out one, that would be, that'd be okay because we want a rising club, but we're trying to squash down. No, no, because it's, this is more of a driver orientated swing. So you've got to almost imagine that you've got two swings. Keep this one as it is for the driver, but feel a little bit out to in. Of course, but it's, it's possible.